My name's Sarah Lord, Faculty and Internships Manager for the Faculty of Science and Technology at Anglia Ruskin University and I'm going to talk to you a little bit today about sandwich placements, short-term placements and all the employability opportunities we offer here. There are massive benefits to doing a work placement. When you look at the um, feedback from students who have undertaken a placement, they really have nothing bad to say about it. They carry over the skills they've learned at university into their work placement. They obviously come in with lots of enthusiasm and ideas and take that into the workplace, which the employers like. But what they learn is the things that you actually can't learn at university, and that's really important for employers. We can't guarantee work placements. Getting a work placement is like getting any other job. You're interviewed, you might have to go to an assessment centre, and there might be a big group interview where you'll have tasks to do during the day. However, if you want it, we will do everything we can to help you with that. We have a huge amount of employers we work with locally who have repeat placements year on year. I suppose one of the most interesting ones we have is we offer four uh, IT placements at Cambridge University um, which have been incredibly successful. This again is a real hub for uh, the built environment industry so for example civil engineers probably won't have a problem, certainly quantity surveyors won't have a problem securing a placement. But any degree you do, if you're keen to do a placement we can help you. Um, our highest paid placement has been about £20,000, although this year I'm actually advertising an engineering placement at £26,000, but the average uh, placement salary is about fourteen to 18000 You won't be undertaking any uh, formal academic modules while you're on your placement year, but you do undertake a 120 placement credit module. You're very well supported with this. We have detailed placement handbooks which can advise you about what you need to do. Um, and you're also supported by uh, an academic placement tutor, your work mentor and by the placements team. If you want to secure a placement, first of all, you have to really want to secure a placement. This isn't something you can do half-heartedly. You have to be incredibly enthusiastic and dedicated to doing it. People are going to interview you and they're going to want to see somebody who's hungry for it and enthusiastic. We will welcome you with open arms and hopefully start you on the road to getting a really great placement.